It's Ariel with your next video. In this video, we're going to cover the general overview. We're going to cover entangled insights and the reporting function. So let's get started. Record your name, record your voice, get inside the program, and go to your system overview. Once you're in the system overview, click on the top one time over the system overview just like that and it'll take you to a screen that says general overview. The general overview allows you to scan every frequency in the matrix at one time which is really fantastic if you want to get an idea of what the main issue is or the top issue is that you need to look at this can really be helpful. Here we see the conception vessel and the large intestine meridian are meridians that should be considered, as well as the neurotransmitter GABA. It also allows us to go to the very um, frequencies that are the most out of balance, the ones that need to be harmonized the most. You can then tap up at general overview one more time, and it'll take you all the way down to the lowest numbers and that's the other ones we want to look at because those are also the ones that are out of balance. So then let's go ahead and let's take the bottom three. So wheat as a food sensitivity, estriol which is E3 the weakest form of estrogen and L5 so the spinal segment at L5 all of those should be considered in the balancing. You could now go tap on the play button go to progressive insights and you could just do your balancing from here you could set the timer for 5 10 or 15 minutes and you could just balance the ones that were the highest and the lowest that's a great way to go and it's really an easy way to do your balancing from the general overview now we're going to look at entangled insights what the the phrase entangled insights suggests is looking at insights we get from the relationship of two things together and often in biofeedback we want to get to the causal chain we want to get to the root cause of what's going on um, let me give you an example let's take something from our general overview that might be a helpful frequency here and let's see if we can go ahead and do an entangled insight on that particular frequency. So let's just go with let's go with the muscular system here. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to actually sort of swipe this to the left and actually correct that swipe it to the right so one more time what I'm going to do here is I'm right here and I'm taking my finger and I'm actually swiping to the right and it says entangled insights and inside this box is an entire database so if we want to find out why our muscles are tight we can now we can now compare it to a number of other frequencies or search for a remedy for example I can tap on this box right here which is the search box and there are a number of Bach flower essences that are in here. So I can then hit Bach flowers all, and I can test to see which one of these Bach flower remedies would be the most beneficial for me or for the person that I'm testing. So just a couple of seconds go by, and we get a result. We always look at the two results at the top and the one result at the very bottom. So, for example, we would consider oak and elm to be beneficial to balancing. We would then go down to the very bottom frequency, and sweet chestnut is one that comes up as well. Now we can take all of our items from our general overview and the ones we got from Entangled Insights and put them all down into our tray to move forward into our progressive insights. And there are many other items in our database in Entangled Insights that we could use for this purpose. The last thing I want to talk to you about today is our reporting function.
and we're back to talk about the reporting function. So I had to switch over from my iPad to my iPhone. I have a genius on each one of them. And I want to now bring your attention to the upper right of your software. And you can see a Pi uh, icon right here. And go ahead and tap on that. That's your reporting function. And this is really wonderful if you want to send the report of an entire session to yourself or someone else. There are email and print options at the bottom. Simply tap on those to send an email or to print out a copy. And you can see all of the results are listed in very organized bar graphs so you can see your scores for all of the different screens that you've run for yourself. So go ahead and do some balancing with the general overview, experiment with the Entangled Insights database, and do some report printout so you can get an idea of what your results were for that session. That's it for now. I'll see you in the next video.